Okay. Well, I can tell you one thing I need. Is to make a bunch of rifle ammo. What am I... Oh, I'm not short on anything right now. Okay. Let's... Make ourselves a here. Um, oh shoot, I really do need to get more PAX mods, that's fine. Uh, okay, let's see, I, I do, I do genuinely, genuinely want to, uh, make uh get a pax mod on here but that's not gonna happen anytime soon so how much is this by the way five percent as opposed to three something oh that is a huge silence <laughs> for some reason i thought it was gonna be small it's not small um is this one smaller yeah i guess it kind of works Hey, how's it going? Hey, fuck! Ah! No, 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 cabrones, Valentinos! Orgullo Pino! Concéntrense en el pinche objetivo, carajo! Oh shit, I am at 2 HP. Oh my god. Yeah, I think it's not a matter of I'm not doing enough damage, it's genuinely a matter of, um... It's actually just a matter of I don't have enough health. I'm a glass cannon right now, and I don't want to be. So I love how they're like, go from the side. And they're not doing that at all. Not great cover. Meant to do a slide there. Good to know that didn't work. <laughs> Holy the hell? Glad to know they have. Oh my god, okay. I'm hit! Ugh. Santa Muerte's chosen me! Ugh. Come on. You have got to be kidding me. <laughs> Okay, I think the best way to activate... Oh, shoot. Ah, dang. Oh. Sand Devastan user. Great. Freaking great. 
also it just looks like the shotgun's comedically missing. It's just it's just decided I'm not hitting anything today. Fair enough, I guess. But apparently you can't dodge. <laughs> Good old Russian iron. Okay, that's good to know. Strange, but good to know. Don't lose faith. Yeah, I guess the shotgun is a pretty good backup. Backup. Honestly, a backup for your backup. Go, motherfucker, go! Still a huge fan of this, though, definitely. Oh my god, okay. Come on. Nice. Uh. Definitely... Dang, I think, like, at the beginning of this playthrough, I was like, hell, I, I just want a D5 and a Unity, or a new, probably, but a Unity will do. Now I'm just like, dang, I gotta use whatever the hell I'm using. Oh, did I shoot that dude's freaking hand off? Which means I shot this other dude's hand off, presumably. Or something, I don't know. Wait a minute, when I opened that, were they two fired shells or were they not? I didn't I didn't actually look. <laughs> oh my god, what? Just, let's try and get the sniper out of the situation. Just entirely and just give him a whistle. Or not. What no? I suppose what I could try and do. I could do an air takedown, or attempt to anyway. Ah, shoot. I don't think this is going to work at all. Don't yeah, this is going to be a tough one. I don't need all these grenades.
Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Well, now I know what they feel like. Ah, shit. Ah, sh devil shit. Oh, jeez. Talk about... An unbelievable amount of meds and an unbelievable amount of bullets to do this. Maybe they they are are also just a little bit too bullet spongy here. I mean, I think if I can actually use the equipment that I pick up, I'm gonna be amazed. I appreciate the thought that I'm butchering them and not just barely scraping by here. Also, is this dude right next to an exploding barrel? No, I don't think so. Shoot. I love how I've not used my rifle at all here. Good lord, okay. That was, uh, that was a true Friday night, Friday, Friday night firefight. Good lord, okay. Was it worth it? <laughs> well, I did a little bit of stealth, kind of. That's what I'm going to tell myself anyways. I'm going to go back here, and I'm going to go uh, rest a day, see if I can get another PAX mod. Who do I spy? Yo, you got, you got stuff? Hey, nice. What even am I looking at for DPS? 436 compared to 302? Dude. Dude, like I don't I don't know if it's just because it's not in my hands, just because it's legendary. I don't know. Oh did I <laughs> did I disassemble that unity? I think I did. Oh well. Also, despite having Jackie's motorcycle, I will probably stick with my car unless something hilarious happens. And it gets like super, super totaled. Hey, it's been a long time. Okaku Okada, the lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. Well, this is going to be a regrettable decision.
I love, I just love the idea that this isn't actually lethal. I don't know how exactly you would go about doing it, like maybe frangible ammo. But like, oh dude, I don't know. Ever sharp and snazzy, Josh. Well, well, who do I spy but V in my humble parlor, no less? Bukako. Long time no see. So what brings you here? We have some outstanding biz to sell. Remember Sandra Dorset? I don't forget such things, V. Here is your reward. It comes with a fairly ample bonus. Go see a Ripper Doc. They'll weave you a dermal imprint that will enable smart gun compatibility. A tiger claw specialty. How many husbands did you have again? Good lord. Once again, we offer you a humble. Oh, hey. Right here. Once again, we offer you a humble thanks. You saved a great many lives. Now, at least I can do it. So, what's the plan now? Can your brother still be a monk? The Pratimoksha vows are a guide to enlightenment, not binding laws. Though my path is paved with ever greater challenges, I shall not give up. Humor me for a sec. If you don't look too kindly on having implants, then... What do you think about constructs? Mm. Ah, yes. You mean the relic. A fashionable subject, is it not? It is a complex, fluctuating affair. It all depends on whether the engram is a copy of a person. Or if this person merely exists in a digital realm. Is a copy of a person still a person? Let's say the engram was just a copy. What then? Could you say that person was... real? If they are truly self-aware, a Buddhist will recognize them as a human being. A perfect copy of a complex human mind is still a human mind. But is it capable of reincarnation? And if it's not, can it still be regarded as a being in possession of a soul? What you're saying in other words is, it's complicated. Suffering is key. It has been there since the dawn of human existence. If a construct can suffer, it is a person. Let's say an engram is just a person that's been digitized. Is that kosher, in your view? Buddhism does not condemn digitization per se. Vending machines are often preached in temples. Mm. No, I would not condemn the simple act of transferal, under the condition that they are at peace with it. One must still remember that they will still be imprisoned in their body. Even if their body is not flesh. Immortality is new thing, I'm guessing. He who cannot die cannot be born into a better life. And will never achieve nirvana. Interesting. What's your take, Johnny? You just you or a copy? What difference does it make? You heard him. I'm trapped in a few lines of code. And your body. Maybe Johnny Silverhand really is dead. Maybe you're just in... Well... What? Imitation? That what you wanted to say? Mm. If the real Johnny Silverhand's dead, then that's his problem. Not mine. You don't say. Feel a headache coming on just thinking about it. Well then, I wish you all the best of luck. Farewell. And do not stray from the path of righteousness.